हेलो एवरीवन आई एम मधुलिका एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माय चैनल अनकॉम्प्लिकेट विद मधुलिका इन टुडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू ऐड अ रिसोर्स टू आर कोर्स इन मूडल नाउ अ रिसोर्स मींस एनी डिवाइस दैट इज एडेड टू सपोर्ट और एनहांस लर्निंग इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू एड अ फाइल रिसोर्स सो लेट्स जम्प राइट इन All right so we are on our site home let's click on the course short name to visit our course here we are on the course page now we want to add a file resource to the first unit that is principles of management to add a file resource we have to put the course in editing mode and for that we have to click on turn editing on so let's click on that okay so our course is in edit mode now click on add an activity or a resource Now you see Moodle gives us a bundle of resources. We have a book, file, folder, IMS content package, a label, page and a URL. Let's click on file to add it. So let's give a name to this file. Now we are adding this as a pre-class activity. Now we add the description in the description box. Now by default this won't be visible to your students since we have not enabled the display description on course page. Let's enable this. Now the same can also be known by clicking on the question mark. It reads if enabled the description above will be displayed on the course page just below the link to the activity or the resource. Now let's upload the file. Now as we don't have this file on our course click on upload a file and choose it from the computer i have selected my file click on upload this file file is uploaded now let's visit the activity completion tab in this if you want that the activity is to be completed by a certain date and time you can enable this in my case it's not required so i'll leave this also there is a completion tracking You have three options here. The students can manually mark the activity as completed. Activity is automatically marked complete when conditions are met or you don't want to indicate activity completion. In my case I don't want to indicate activity completion. So I will select that do not indicate activity completion. Once you're done click on save and return to course. So our file resource is now added to our unit. Click on turn editing off to finalize the changes. So this is our file resource. Now let's switch our role to a student and see how this file resource is visible to them. Now we are in a student role and we have opened the file resource. So this is our file. Now an important point to note here is that the file resource has opened in the same browser as the course which means that the students have gone away from the course now this happens due to our appearance settings by default automatic is selected in the appearance settings we will explore the different appearance settings in the next video till then Thank you so much for watching the video and you have uploaded a file resource and if you've liked it then please like the video and subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions comments suggestions or feedback please write to me in the comment section below